I spend about five hours a day just hanging out inside my giant Stanley Cup. My name is Karen. I'm from Orange County and I'm addicted to Stanley Cups. One, two, three. If there's one thing I learned from my husband, it's that size matters. And that's why I got a bigger Stanley Cup. It's like a normal cup, except it's four feet tall. So it's way better. I take her with me everywhere I go. <laughs> I'm the biggest Stanley Cup fan. And my ultimate goal in life is to become the face of Stanley Cups. Stanley office headquarters. Hey, it's me, Karen, again. I was just wondering if you could... Uh Hello? There's so many people online that try to say Stanley Cups are overrated. But like, if you're broke, just say that, honey. Stanley Cups are also great for sports. Kobe! Oh, 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 oh no. Okay. Kobe! Ladies, I just want to remind you how much I love and appreciate you. And yes, I do love you more than my mom. One of the hardest decisions I have every single morning is trying to figure out which Stanley Cup I want to take out with me that day. As you can see, I have a lot of options. But you know what? God gave me two hands for a reason. All I'm saying is that there's people that have Stanley Cups and then there's Hydro Flask users. Yeah, let's uh, we don't talk about those people. The other day, my kids gave me a hydro flask for my birthday. Can you believe that? A hydro flask? Seriously? Pissed me off. You know what it is? You guys remind me so much of myself. You're strong, beautiful, the talk of the town. Everyone wants you. Come on, watch your form, Karen. Watch your form. There you go. Sorry, I can't hear you haters over my cup. And you're just perfect in every possible way, just like me. <laughs> I haven't tested it yet, but I'm pretty sure this would survive a nuclear bomb. <laughs> it's one thing to have a Stanley Cup, but a true Stanley stand would also have accessories. Right here is my little Stanley Cup food tray. So now I can have my little treats while I sip on my margarita. I, I mean, water. So you know how people collect Pokemon cards, Funko Pops, and just like useless things? Well, I collect actual valuables. What you're looking at right here is the Stanley Cup that got burnt in the infamous car fire. I spent over $15,000 to win this in an auction. And I'll tell you right now, it was worth every single penny. Do you hear that? That's the original ice. There is one thing I don't like about these cups, and it's that they're too good. Four weeks and it kept the ice icy cold. Yeah, I know. Every single morning, I make sure to always do quality control. Still cold. Still cold. Still cold. Because I love Stanley Cups so much, I decided to start a TikTok fan page. Hey TikTok, here are 10 reasons why you need to get a Stanley Cup. Reason number one, they are so cute. Number two, great quality. Number three, status. If you want to be better than everyone else, then you need to get a Stanley Cup. My life used to be extremely pathetic, but now that I have Stanley Cups, I am better than everyone. Hey guys, apparently the Crazy Gorilla is giving away a brand new Stanley Cup to a random subscriber. So make sure you comment down below done after subscribing. Good luck. Collectively, I have 1,193 Stanley Cups. One thing about me is that I will literally do anything for a Stanley Cup exclusive, and I mean anything. A couple of weeks ago, there's this video from Target that went viral, and uh, let me just tell you, I understand. Because if I was at Target and there was a Target exclusive, then you best believe I'm knocking someone now. <laughs> I have a Stanley Cup for every single occasion, whether it's a birthday, a wedding, a funeral, it doesn't matter. I have a perfect Stanley Cup just for that day. I have everything from the Crazy Gorilla collab to the Pepto-Bismol one. Oh, that's pretty cute, huh? It's like nice and pink. I even have the Cockroach collab. Not many people have this one. And I also have the exclusive infamous laxative collab. There's only five of these I've ever released. I had to fight a grandma, but you know, she's okay. She's not with us anymore, but she's okay. My husband always complains about me spending $500 a week on Stanley Cups, but like, I just don't understand why he can't just like work more. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hold on. Someone stole one of my blue Stanley Cups.
Who, who, who did, did, did you take it? You took it. Give me my cup back. Give me my cup back. Did you take it, cameraman? Did you take it? Give it to me. So, how exactly did people drink water before Stanley Cups? Seriously, I want to know. Technically, I don't officially work for Stanley Cups, but I consider myself the marketing director. Day five of giving Stanley Cups away. Excuse me, sir, uh, would you like a free Stanley Cup? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Thank you. Remember, spread the love with hashtag Stanley Joy. Okay, give it back. Wait, what, what are you talking about? I'm not gonna just give you a Stanley Cup for free. These are expensive, buddy. But you said. It was for a video. And then over here, I have my Stanley Cup handbag attachment because nothing says I'm rich more than a Stanley on my hip. Look, Ma, no hands. Hey, ladies, I'm currently on my Stanley walk, and don't forget, the more cups in your hand, the higher the chance to find a man. Me and my girlfriends always say this one quote, a Stanley Cup a day keeps the broke people away. I cannot believe people really live life without Stanley Cups. <sighs> Peasants. <laughs> There's nothing in this world I love more than the sound of the Stanley Cup. Wait until you hear ice in my giant Stanley Cup. <laughs> Music to my ears. <laughs> There's absolutely no one in the world that loves Stanley Cups more than me. And that is why I should be the face of the brand. Stanley office headquarters. Hey, it's me, Karen, again. Um, I think our last call got dropped, but what I was trying to ask you was that like, hello? Hello? You know what? I'm gonna just go in person now. Hey, sweetheart, it's me again. Karen, this is the 40th time you've shown up this week. You can't keep showing up here to headquarters. I, I know, I know, but like, you don't understand. I really need to meet the CEO. I think I would be a great face for the brand. Yes, you say that every time, and every time the answer is no. But come on, the, the least you guys could do is set up a meeting because I spent so much money on you guys' products. Come on. Karen, you need to leave right now. I, I'm not gonna leave until I get that meeting, okay? I think the CEO would really love me. I'll call security. No, 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 no. we don't need to call security, okay? You guys are making such a big deal. I, so, so, like, I just need a simple meeting, okay? I would be a great brand ambassador. Get your head off me, okay? Get your head off me. 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 Come here. I said come here! Please, I need to meet him! We're leaving! We're leaving! Come on now! If you think I should be the face of Stanley Cups, then comment down below, Carrot.